But I see social CRM as the function where you are able, using social technologies inside the company, bringing in the customer insights that are generated where from those parts of the business where you're facing the customer, bringing it across, sharing it across the business, so it's product development, product support, and so on, um, making it easy to uh, process a lot of insights, making it easy to put for the right people to have the right information about the customer, um, thus becoming more of a customer-focused business. The, the other aspect where I've seen social networks internally help with the CRM is where you highlight uh, events that are, that are happening in your background customer systems and you're able to manage exceptions much better because you actually use uh, social dynamics of getting the right people to collaborate over, across silos to help uh, solve problems for customers, to help um, get the, um, the, the, the right services to customers at the right time. So it's about information and time. It's about information and time and it's about the, the um, the entire company being as close to the customer as possible because you, you break down the distances, you break down the access to information, you get it, and this is where you have the, the concept of the edge that is facing the customer. You want to bring the middle as close to the edge as possible. Right. Information, time, and intimacy. Lisa, you've got to beat that now. Your definition of uh, social CI and how you use it and why. Well, I guess, I guess the broadest definition of social CRM would be, um, I guess, the the uh, ability to re reach out to engage, uh, drive loyalty, and then ultimately deliver customer service to your customers through CRM, through social. Um, I think that um, I think different companies have different challenges, and you know the ideal of actually drawing up in one uh, customer view. The, a, a customer's social activity and I guess their intimate customer data, that, that's something I think we're quite a long way, way, way away from and realistically for a bank it's very hard to align the two where one's very public and the other is usually very true and very private. Um, I think social CRM is about using social media where it can play a role in the customer relationship potentially other types of communication can't do. So a good example of that would be what we're doing um, with the younger age of market um, at HSBC where you know, for someone of my age, email is a natural place for you to communicate with a brand and with a, a service. So for younger people, you know, social media is their natural world. And so we deliver the example in the email marketing to a customer base, but with our young youth audience with all of our customer services given to Facebook instead. So when I think about you know, using social where uh, it's a natural place for our customers and where we can build uh, a relationship and our value to 